Good morning, everyone. Today is Monday, June 1st at 8 a.m. Gonna do a video watch list today. So for those that don't know, I do a free video watch list every Monday on YouTube. And then every day or every other day, I do a video watch list for the members in MIC. So today is Monday, uh, watch list plus, I'm gonna do a recap at 11 a.m. today on YouTube. So uh, let's get started. Um, before I start again, I wanna mention that the Jumpstart Accelerator is finally out for release. This is a seven hour course that will take you from not knowing anything about trading to placing your first trade in seven hours. Uh, we have two things that are available. You could either buy the course for itself or you could buy an annual membership and get the course for free. This promotion is only for one month. So that's it. Let me get started. So SNOA, this is a low hanging fruit. Um, if you look at it, the reason why it's a low hanging fruit is because it tanked, right? It gave back its move. And today we're looking for a pop to short very early in the morning we got up to 11 but shit there was really no volume here to really attack it so you know what i see in the morning is i see kind of this 10 20s level right and again i'm just drawing my lines 10 50 and 11. oops so looking to short a morning pop 10 10 50 11. i don't really think i'm going to chase weakness here um let me go to the next one phio again another low-hanging fruit look everyone was so excited to buy 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 and then boom smoked so what i'm looking for on something like this is i want to see a morning pop so give me a second it's 324 but i kind of rounded it up to 330 uh 345 i rounded it up to like 350 and 365s. Again, I will not chase weakness on this because it's already tanked from six to three. So take chasing weakness on this. What's what are you gonna make ten cents on it? It doesn't it doesn't make sense to chase weakness on this. Um, ADAP ADAP. I'm watching. Um, if you notice, uh, this is kind of uh, like ABIO, right? So kind of like ABIO where it has first day move, tanked on day two, and here we are. So ADAP, my plan is to scale this one, right? I want to scale 1050, 1050 and 11. If it pushes through 1050 and just starts to slowly fade, I will add to my winner as long as the stock is under VWAP. CTX had a big move pre-market. As soon as 7 a.m. came around, it dumped and it still looks very, very, very heavy. Um, so I'm looking to short any pop I get on this right here. I see 290. Hey shit, maybe I'll settle for even better. 190-ish, right? 190. See if we could get some around 2, 205. And then some around 215. So hopefully this pops in the morning. It looks kind of weak so far. Support is at 165. So it might just wash and tank all day. Hopefully not. AYTU is a potential hot chick of the day. Um, just kind of got to wait and see what it does. Not really in love with it yet. I think a PR just hit well before I did my watch list, so I'm gonna wait. And DKNG DraftKings is a potential first red day setup. We have one, two, three, four, five, six green days in a row, looking to short it when it goes red uh, for a quick nail and bail trade. Um, I think that's it, everyone. I'm gonna keep it short and sweet so that everyone makes it to the end. Um, again, if you have any questions about joining or questions about trading, you would text us at 213-458-5997. And at the end of these videos, I do a secret word to make sure that you guys watch till the end of it. Um, so today's secret word is gonna be post it. So thanks everyone and I will see you in the room.